phase one spooky. Very Terminator like. Yeah. Actually, scroll back up. Very Ultron in the head. Oh yeah. Now that yeah, you're right. Now that I realize it. Hmm. And the Ultron had been around since what the eighties, I think. Oh, at least he, he's probably older than that. I think because I remember him on a series one Marvel card from eighty nine or ninety. So he probably came out of the eighties. I'm guessing. Oh, that's funny. I look up Ultron, and then. I guess there's rumors that James Spader is returning as Ultron. Oh, that's right. That's right. Six sixty-eight. First appearance. Oh, really? 68. That that old. Yep. <clears throat> uh, ER camera. Not my favorite level. Probably easily my least favorite because it's challenging and. Every so often, I have to play it again because I use my, all my lives. Mm-hmm. I think there might have been one playthrough where I didn't use all my lives. So, well, God willing, God willing, this will be this will be another one of those playthroughs. Yeah. I'll just be very, very, very careful. I think the main, one of the main difficulties is the part where you're going on the conveyor belt. Yeah, that was pretty challenging. And really they, just... Like, they, the, they fork. Yeah. And then you like crouch down and I think you go in between at one point. And... Mm-hmm. Okay. God damn it. Had to be facing the opposite way. This is Job already. The, I know. This is already laser cutter. Taking me to areas I don't necessarily want to go to yet. I don't think you got a choice. No, I will eventually. I got it. I just want to clear. Oh this right, shit right. First, and then I'll ride that up. Think. Or no, that comes down. If I came from up top, I think. Guess I'm ready for this. I think if I recall, I think I trigger it to come over. Um, you or, can shoot it. Oh, that's right. And then you can also run past it. I think, and nothing happens. Yeah. I think. Yeah. I think mean, you gotta. You just gotta run. Yeah, I guess I will. Fucking. Gotcha! <laughs> That's how they get you, Jerry! <laughs> <laughs> That's gold! That's gold, Jerry! That's like discovering plutonium on accident. <laughs> I love the Switch. That's my favorite episode. <laughs> She's into it. <laughs> <laughs> the way he says it. She's I just love that into it. They they spend all that time, you know, the montage of them coming up with the, the plan for the Switch between <laughs> the girlfriend and the roommate. Ah! I can't remember. Can you drop down there or is that death? There's... No, that's death. Uh, okay. 100%. You will definitely hear the canned scream. <sighs> okay, Almost that went as back up. As the Wilhelm scream. Yeah, so you got to go back up and now you can go across that <sighs> platform to that door. Okay. That's right. That's right. Okay. It's all coming back. Sure, say that line a lot. Mm -hmm. I think they'd just be shoot first, ask questions later. Uh oh. 
I heard that sound. Mm. I think Come he's down you. below. Yeah, there's like a phase. Let's see. I think it's a phase oh, one. Oh, you know what? Um, down. So down there. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, there's a phase one, and I think a phase two's down on the other. Yeah. Spot. Yeah. And there's also one of those laser cutting arms too. Right. Man, I just keep hitting him. I should try rolling one down. Can't remember. Is it Z? I think it's Alt. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> got him. Uh, now I'm wondering if I should. I guess I got to jump down. Well, so I could go that way too, but there's there's dark a. Over did there. you go down that? Go down that. Down there is like I think a dead end. But watch out for there's uh. Down that way, if you go into that. Little there's niche. like a hallway, yeah, but there's um the the auto turrets on the ceiling. Oh, I okay. Think. So just get ready to shoot them. Let me see. Do slight page up. Ooh. Didn't, didn't need, need it. it. <laughs> I've been hoarding, hoarding the ammo. Yeah. That's the thing. I go through my Stormtrooper blaster cells so much and then nothing else. Uh, let's see. Okay. As far as I know. Okay. That's good. Surrender immediately. Shit. Guess I'll just head in here. There's gonna be one that flies in from the left, I think. Yeah, that sounds right. Or maybe it's down. Down below. Well, it. Uh, oh, I you know, know there's some. There's, there's one, one in the below. room across from yeah. there. Yeah. I, d I definitely maybe maybe know it's that. when you turn this corner. And it's like on there's, the far end. I remember. I think there's one that's gonna fly in when you turn this corner. I think it's on the left here, maybe. Although I played this on hard, so there's a lot more. There stuff is more dark troopers too. Yeah, I can't even contemplate doing this on hard. It was not easy. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, I play Tie Fighter on hard, and it's like I kick ass at it. But uh, it's just a different see. type of game. It is. Well, I'm gonna be prepared. Oh, something's flying in. I heard a door. You. There was a. Creep. I know. I think that was. I think that was a dark trooper flying around. On the left. Over over here somewhere. If go yeah. If you go back the other way, there was something flying around. I hate that this thing blocks my know. right vision. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> okay. I mean, I right now I could just jump down here. I know for a fact there's a dark trooper down here. I don't know if it's mm -hmm. phase one or phase... Oh, I heard the phase one, I think. No, not hitting him. See the alt, alt fire. I always hit... Just... Shit. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> it's the most... <laughs> non-mechanical scream ever it's like it's like a dude ah. <laughs> okay is he here he keeps moving he's running around down there like a maniac <laughs> this is taking so long I gotta do what I gotta do. <laughs> you, you know, you could throw them a little faster. Oh, that's true, huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <clears throat> you know, this is either multiple phase ones or it's a phase two, but I, I don't think the phase two makes that sound. So, you know what? I think this is multiple phase 
ones. Because I think there is two might, or three. It might be, yeah. I think I might have got I think it's, I think you're done. Yeah. Here's the moment of truth. Yep. I only see Laid one. out. <laughs> but, all right. I know there's well, more. Well, if they're like grazing, if it's just grazing hits with the... Yeah. Oh, that, AOE that's... AOE damage. Yeah. Oh! Good cheer. <laughs> Blocking your shots. <laughs> Cheaters win sometimes. Oh, here we go. Come here, buddy. Ha! That was the one I was really worried about. That's what I needed, some some regular health for my vitals, not just my shield. <laughs> you hear that sound? It was like it was like a partial like oh that's what it was. It scared me because it sounded like the dark trooper uh thruster. Don't want to grab that superpower quite yet, but well. I don't think you have too much of a choice. I know. Might as well just snag it and then jump down here, because I think there might still be. No, I thought there was another corner. Oh well. Making sure everything is. Safe down here. All right. Yeah, this level is also very maze-like. That was the other thing. I mean, other levels are worse in that regard, but it's still pretty challenging. Yeah. Gotta jump back across, right? Yeah, I guess that is it. I know I know at some point I did. I guess this is it. There we go. No, it's gonna be the uh, yeah. Over that here. door that was shit. That one. Was that get it? Get ready for a dark trooper, yeah. Shit, that is it. Okay. Yep. Get ready for a dark trooper. Yeah. There. That's the good part, is at least I could... Keep his legs. Sweep the leg. <laughs> no. Okay. Where's oh yeah, you've been you've been watching uh, the Karate Kids, right? Yeah, you've just just them? finished the Cobra Kai uh, a few days ago. It was good, and I I hadn't seen any Karate Kids, any anything. I I binged that's, it all. It's crazy. Yeah, it is for an '80s kid. Yeah. <laughs> It's funny because, um, what was it, a few days ago the, the nephew was over. Oh, everybody was over because it was uh, my daughter's birthday. Mm -hmm. And um, I uh, I don't remember what it was. Like, he, my nephew's like seven years old and he, um, I, I can't remember why, but he was like, oh, you got roasted, you got roasted. <laughs> I think, like, Lexi had said something. And they were all excited about it toward me, like being all smart alecky and stuff. Mm -hmm. And he's like, oh, you got roasted. And I just, <laughs> I just turned around. I was like walking down the hall. I turned around. He was sitting at the, they're all sitting at the, 
dining room table playing playing games or whatever. I just came. I just went over to him, a little slow, and I just like leaned in, and you know, whispered in his ear, um, just in a low voice. It was just like, "You want me to roast you?" Oh. And like <laughs> he just started bawling. He just started crying, and like I was like, "What the heck?" Like I wasn't even like I'm not gonna, you know, I was just being uh, <laughs> smart, smart ass to him and stuff. And uh, and then I realized um, part of the problem, aside from my dry sense of humor, is um, right now, especially as my wife likes to point out, um, I have the whole '80s bad guy vibe going on <laughs> with my po- with right. my ponytail, and right. I realized that um, part of that is Karate Kid Three. Yep. That uh, Terry I don't remember the character. Silver. I think Is that it's, his name? Yeah, I, haven't I, think, watched that, I haven't watched that movie in like yeah, 25 years. Yeah. So. I didn't know what to expect with all three movies because even though I had seen pieces mostly of the first one, the two and three, mm-hmm. I, I wasn't really familiar with at all in, on any level. So when when that character showed up, I was just like, who the hell is this weird dude? And yeah. I, I ended up really liking his character, actually. Um, he's... Mm-hmm. I don't know. He's kind of like the Joker. If he, if the Joker was a martial artist, because he has this <laughs> m- maniacal kind of vibe to him. Yeah. It's not a, it's not a terrible movie as far as an, as an installment. In no, it's not. Karate Kid. It's, it's the weakest I think of the trilogy, but it's still, oh shit, it's still okay. It actually had some things I, li- I genuinely liked about it. Yeah. Um. That stormtrooper go. Blend it in. Well, I know. It's camouflage. Wow, it actually worked. His white armor. So when you go up, you gotta like jump across or whatever, right? Yeah. Kind of a tough jump. It's not it's just too that bad. Lip that you gotta. Yeah, you it's gotta a little lip. Jump onto. As long as you just press. Oh, see, this sucks because now my headlight's gone. As long as you just press, uh, keep pressing forward, it's okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, I screwed that up. I knew as soon as I hit jump too early, I was screwing that up. Huh, where am I going? Hey, right, there we go. <laughs> Such a harsh sound. Okay. But yeah, I, I enjoyed Karate Kid 3. It was, I mean, it was the weakest of the three, but it was still, it was decent. It had some good parts. There we go. And then, oh, that's right. You got to jump and like hit that button. I don't know that you have to. I think that might be connected to a it... secret, right? Actually, you know what? Maybe, maybe you're right. You got to jump because there's a lip. No, there's a lip there. Oh, there so is. You can jump. There is. Yeah, you can jump uh, to that part. And hang on that. Yeah, I think there's a lip. I think. I don't. I don't think maybe there not. is. Maybe I, not. This maybe one. Not. Yeah, I remember. You have to just jump and press it, which isn't super hard. But then that opens something, and I can't remember what. Four hours later. <laughs> <laughs> It'll. We'll just jump ahead and put the text on the screen. Like it's a sitcom or something. Uh, so did you watch Karate Kid 4? Yeah, <clears throat> I did actually. I, I wanted to make sure to see that it is part of the what they call the Miyagi-verse. And is that, is that what they call they it? They call it that actually. The, the Cobra Kai showrunners, they call it the Miyagi-verse. They That's consider fun. anything as canon as long as it had Mr. Miyagi. Right. And actually, you know, I said it in my post, but like, I, I kind of enjoy the next Karate Kid. It was, there was some things that were worse than three, but there was some things that were better than three. And the fact that it had Michael Ironside was a plus. Yeah. So. He, he definitely elevates anything he's Anything, in. yeah. Okay. What did it do? This? No. No. No, is is it uh I don't think it's time sensitive. Did it something. Not to be well, there you go. 
did something. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Right. Unless I just got to go back up again. If it's not time sensitive, maybe it did do something up up above. Because I, I looked down there pretty well. Make sure this... Zoom in here. Okay, there's nothing that way. Do you plan on watching the Karate Kid remake with... Oh, this is what I do. There's a lip here. Yeah, well, that's... We, you know. Oh, the remake? No. I, I can't stand Jaden Smith. I like Jackie Chan, but the fact that Jaden Smith is in it, I can't. I can't stand that kid. I um, I just get weirded out that it's called the Karate Kid, but it's not karate. So yeah, I, that, I refuse I to that. watch it based on that because it's Jackie Chan and they're in China and they're doing kung fu. They should have called it the Kung Fu Kid. I don't understand right. why they do that. Obviously, they were milking the uh, the uh, name for all all of us. Oh, Gen Xers that were nostalgic. Kind of weird. Yeah, and they, uh, that was another thing the showrunners had to clarify for people that were asking. They, they don't consider that part of the, the universe. That's good. Yeah. Okay, I know I go into there, but what's this? Okay, it's nothing. Damn, I forgot I still got to do the conveyor belt part. Mm -hmm. This level is pretty long. Mm -hmm. And that's the part I don't... Oh, I haven't even set one sequencer charge. Okay, the first one is, I think, up down here. Yeah, there it is. Shit. Hate how that... There's always a delay. That's the worst. Mm. Okay. And they don't, they, they go ham right <laughs> off the bat. I don't even think it was hitting. Fuck. I'm wondering if I should just go down there. I don't know. I remember having trouble. Oh wait, here we go. There's a little niche. Actually, what I could do. Uh, let's see. I think, I think I'll try that. Make sure I'm high enough. I think my main complaint with the next Karate Kid is, um, and uh, a lot of. Uh, deep sequels have this problem in general um, is that it just didn't feel very cinematic mm. it felt more like a TV movie yeah okay and and diff different things can cause that um, I don't know for certain I think it's the camera or the camera work or yeah, the cinematography in yeah. that movie that does it for me but <clears throat> uh, there's another movie that that does that, um, and it's actually um, kind of odd, but it's um, Godzilla vs. Space Godzilla. Oh, what? And is that a recent one or? No, no, no. It's from it's from the um, the nineties. Okay. The, uh, well, I, I consider anything right. the Hesse... past eighty five to be recent Godzilla, but yeah, okay. Yeah, so it's in the it's in the Hesse. I think that's how you pronounce it. I'm yeah. Not sure. Um, series. So from. Uh, Godzilla 1985 all the way to um, Godzilla vs. Destroya. Right. And the the reason that Space Godzilla doesn't seem cinematic to me is they um, got a different composer for it mm -hmm. and the music in that movie and just that movie it just sounds like generic TV movie. Yeah quality it's yeah. weird it it's um i don't i don't know if it's just how they reuse the theme of that movie or just the 
whatever synthesized instruments they use or whatever, but it just um, it smacks of TV movie. Right. Now, More than any of the other movies at that at that time from the Godzilla series, and they all pretty much have the same quality. Yeah. But that one feels like a TV movie just because of the soundtrack. I don't remember where to go now after that first sequencer because that was kind of a dead end where it was. Like there was uh, some, look mean, at your math. I, I think there was uh, some pipes and stuff. Uh, let's see. See, that's the problem. Now I'm on the lower level. It's not showing the upper. Uh, I I could probably get up there without too much trouble again, but let me see. It seemed like a dead. I'm too busy. I'm too busy talking about Karate Kid and Space Godzilla <laughs> to be much of a help right now. <laughs> You're like, yeah, yeah, that's great. Now, where do I go? <laughs> I know, right? Yeah, yeah, Space Godzilla. <laughs> that's cool, go. man. Let's see. So glad that switch is permanently pushed. I'm like, I don't want to do that again. Well, do we ever figure out what it's for? Yeah, it just opened up. I think it slid down that, that niche that allowed me to walk across that. I think that's all it did. Mm. Mm. Okay, so... Oh, you know what? I don't think I went straight. <laughs> oh, wait. No, I killed that guy, obviously. Okay, I, I went left. Oh, this is open now. Never mind. So when, this, when I placed the sequencer, that opened up the next section of the level, I guess. Yeah, yeah. And I think that's the case for part two here. It'll be segmented. Ah, <sighs> 26 health. Uh, let me s check my... Oh, shit. Can't even, <laughs> can't even check my PDA, man. PDA, PDF or PDA? Public display of affection? No, my... Uh, let me check my thing. Okay. Can I hit it from here? No, I guess I gotta hit, hit out. Is it F7? No. F1, I think. Yeah, there we go. Because I feel like I'm on my last life, but I probably have like... Wait, wait. Oh, no, you're... Uh, you oh, got three lives. I, I see down it. down in your... Yeah, yeah, I see it now. <laughs> I was like... So, but that was the thing. I'm so paranoid, and because I died once or twice, I'm like, I have zero lives. And I forget that, like, I've been racking up one-ups through the whole game. Yeah, I think at one point you had, like, seven or eight lives. Yeah, that sounds right. Okay, so I ride that up there. Actually, make sure there's nothing down here. Okay. Hopefully this is easier than the uh, sewer uh, platforming from er from the uh, detention level. Yeah, I, be I believe it's a little bit easier. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah, we'll find out. Oh, I was on it and I fell off. Okay, there we go. And then I get over there. Okay, and then... I can't tell if that part to the right over here is something I can get inside. Or if it's just... If I should risk it. No, I think I think you can get in there. Yeah. Probably is, hopefully power ups. I don't. I don't think it's. I don't think it's very dicey. I think you just have to get on that and then. Shit. Yeah. Try and yeah. There you go. <laughs> okay. This. Okay. Oh, I kind of remember this. Now, now, now this is. Yeah, this dicey. is dicey. <laughs> I I do remember this. You have to like run and duck, and then get in that little section over there. Okay, this is safe. I think, yeah. Making sure it's not hurting me. Okay. It's weird. It's like pushing my head down, but it's not hurting me. But I'm like, yeah, because because you have room to duck. Right. So. Okay, so I gotta. Run. I don't even know if I need to go this way, but I'm here. So. 
Well, if you get smushed, if you get smushed, you're done because you don't have any shields. Ah! Oh shit! I made it in and then I just like <laughs> ran out. <laughs> God damn it! There goes one of your three lives. Well, I'm not going to go that way if the opportunity presents itself again. I mean, I, it, it's possible that's just an alternate route or something. Or maybe that is the I way. See, I seem to recall, no, I seem to recall going through there, but having to come back. So yeah. So I think it's just a, a dead end with power-ups. That could be. And it's harder coming back than it is going... Going... I remember there's one of these rooms with a bunch of uh, landmines on the ground again. Uh, it might be. That's a dark area though. Okay, that's. Yeah, um, I think I think there's a few. Towards. And that's me. if you if you fall off these conveyors, um, or the conveyor parts coming up later. Yeah. Um, yeah. They they drop you into those rooms. So you got to be careful. Right. Okay, that's locked. I think I just keep. I think I do gotta go down there. Poor asteroids. I feel bad every time I kill I them. I need my flashlight charged <laughs> up. Probably just something I would fall into if I was up there, I guess. See, now I got all this blaster power. And I'm just using my other thing. Oh shit. That bastard got like five this, shots on me. This line coming up so cheesy. Freedom. <laughs> I forgot about that until you mentioned it. For freedom. That's that is pretty pretty terrible. Okay, now that conveyor's going the way I want it. <sighs> Let's see, I'll go ahead and switch to this again. And then I'm guessing that door is open over here, that one that was previously closed. So far I feel like I'm doing alright. I don't want to jinx myself, and I probably just did, but... You're doing better than my playthrough, but hard is very difficult. Yeah. I don't even know why I bothered. <laughs> I like how they're not moving yet. Gotta sneak up on them. Oh, that was deadlier than I thought. Shit. A little bit. 63 <laughs> health. God damn. Okay, this is that dark area I was thinking of. Shit, switch. Now remember if you if you backtrack, if you back up and you go a little bit slower and give yourself a little bit more time. More time, on yeah. These right. <laughs> oh shit, shit, shit. I noticed that thing right then. <laughs> the deadliest weapon.
Yeah, fuck Dark Troopers. It's all about the fucking ceiling turrets in this game. Dude, seriously. I thought that was the fucking things I blow up. Oh! <laughs> you should have used your <laughs> night vision. You I know, I, I, I should have warned you. I think well, I remember that part. No, I, I did have some night vision. I, I, I thought I was out for a long time because I didn't have any for a long time. But then, thankfully, these guys have been refilling it. No, I, I that was such a a self ass fuck rookie mistake <laughs> self ass fuck <laughs> <laughs> what a cumbersome way <laughs> to say that okay <laughs> is there any more okay there is not. Alright. Oh, that would have come in handy fucking two minutes ago. Mm hmm. Oh well. C'est la vie. Okay. Uh, let's see. This way. Oh. Did I already hit that? Okay, that's the deadly part. Whoa. Okay, I see one there. Let's see. It still hurts me. Dude, their splash zone is huge. I know, man. Oh my gosh, really? It just can't get really like that. Just just get close and do the alt fire and then back there. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, this like dude's trying to kill me. I know there's still a couple more. Yeah, you're getting... <laughs> I just imagine Kyle getting shot at <laughs> he's, and he's, he's ignoring the fire <laughs> he's just like concentrating on this stupid mind trying to trigger oh, it fucking oh already down to the bills it'd be Good if you could shoot them. I guess you can't shoot them, can you? No, I don't think. You gotta like get close and then like run back up or something. I could probably point Trigger down. Them. Oh, you know what? Maybe I could page down from. I don't. I don't think you can shoot them. I think I tried doing this on my way through. I think you're right. It's annoying. That is bullshit. I'm still okay. Well, that's fine. Just just go around it. Yeah, I'm just because it's it's just there to to make it hard to make OCD people like me feel like they need to blow everything up. Yeah, that that's something I hate. I hate having the nagging need Watch to get every item that. and. It's nothing over there. I didn't think so. All right. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Nothing else. It's over here. Did I come from this? Oh, that's what. Yeah, you came from here. I don't even know where I am anymore. Okay. Uh, actually, I went up a lift I wasn't expecting. Um, I, I guess I. Yeah. Just... So you're back. You're back at the start of this area. Okay. No, don't go this way. Yeah. 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 Oh wait, dead end. Wait, go back this way, right? Because this is where you come in, yeah. And then you went right, and then down the conveyors. Right. Oh, yeah. And there's nothing else I need in here. 
Yeah. So what are we gonna play after this? We're gonna play like what Yoda stories? <laughs> Get all the '90s Star Wars stuff out of the way. Oh shit! Hold on a second. I think I do gotta shoot that right. Seems reasonable. Seems, seems important, but okay. I think it opened. Oh, it opened oh. that. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh, love that sound effect. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. It's like uh, Duke Nukem trying to open Look for Secrets. Uh, 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 uh. Where is it? <laughs> that was scary. Alright. Just glad that wasn't a dark trooper or something. This, this would be the corridor if if the copy protection had Vader. <laughs> yeah. You'd get all the way to this part of the game and then he'd show up at the end of it and just kill you. Serious. Whoa. You see that glitch? Whoa. He just like That's spooky. Dude, that I've never seen that in this I've game. never seen I've never seen that. <laughs> I've never seen a glitch like that in any old game like no. this. Oh. <laughs> that was well, got it on camera. <laughs> Gotta submit that to Coast to Coast. <laughs> I was just gonna say. Hey, uh, Contact George. Nori and Nap. <laughs> I got something for you. I don't no, know. No, the wrong way. That was the wrong, the wrong way. way. I thought that as soon as I dropped. I guess it's whichever way oh, well, it has I guess... conveyors. You know what? I hadn't been in here, though. This particular. Well, yeah, no, but. You don't want to be in here. I mean, well, it's got some power. No, I, I, I got some shields, so it's okay. I'll be sure to check every nook and cranny. Okay, more thermal detonators. That's good. Wasn't a total loss. Wait. So I wonder if there is a, if there's enough paranormal video game material to start podcast a regular like show or something covering it like a, a paranormal game to to match what we're talking about no just like you know that that uh death star trooper or whatever oh yeah yeah like teleporting oh, on the screen yeah <laughs> enough like glitches and weird weird kind yeah of shit. oh shit this person was playing doom and one of the pinky demons <laughs> disappeared. You know, right. Like stupid, stupid stories like that. Okay, I think I run around the perimeter. You can just shoot them from in here. Just shoot the base of them. Oh, is that what it is? It's the base. Yeah. I was yeah, like trying to remember base. what part, if it was the tip or the base. Just the tip. <laughs> there you go. Be like just like Bigger's Canyon back home. That almost sounds, when you hit it, it reminds me of the War of the Worlds uh, laser from... Oh, kind of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's such a good sound. I know, it's I, I think I mentioned it on Facebook, but I would, like, if... I feel like whenever they make new, like, versions of War of the Worlds on film and stuff, they they kind of nowadays obsess with... Um, accuracy to the book so yeah. they make it like tripods and stuff right but I feel like the 50s version or was Dude. it the 50s yeah, yeah that, that's the one yeah, for yeah, me 50s. with the flying ones. it was that one did it right like it, it wasn't a tripod but it's like that was even by the 50s it's like come on they, they wouldn't have tripods you know that's like a archaic way of thinking it, about how aliens yeah. would traverse landscape and, so you know what's interesting too the only reason they did flying machines in that was because because they were they did do some stop motion tripod tests and it just didn't look super great mm -hmm. so they even did some stop oh, motion man. is there alien. any footage is there footage of uh there i don't of the test i don't think there's footage shit you got it i gotta That's jump right. that wall um mm -hmm. I don't think there's footage of the tripods, but there's footage. I think that Ray Harryhausen did 
because he briefly worked on the movie for the alien for the alien there's there's stop motion it's like coming out of the cylinder yeah and it's on the uh the extras for uh, one of the versions am i going the right way do i need to go uh, i'm not sure i'm not sure just back it up all the way there and then i think you want to go left yeah, yeah. So anyway anywhere there's uh another thingy fuck down down I hate how fast you have to do it. It's like... Yeah, yeah. And it doesn't help that my fucking wrist is killing me right now because of yeah. cramming it for three levels today. The mm -hmm. torture. But, uh... <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah, they... I, I, I wish that they would remake it, but remake... Or, or have a sequel, you know, there's that sequel series from the 80s. That Which I loved and I've, I've gushed about for so many fucking balls. Um, where am I? What's my name? Well, that's uh, I want more of those those um, ships. Yes, and, yes. And the sound effects and the whole thing. Like yes. the, the design on those ships is just the ultimate, I feel like. Yeah. Up, up, Fucking down. balls. You know what I need to remember is to hold back the whole time. That's my mm -hmm. problem. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. But uh, speaking of the 80 series, because I've seen all of season one and um, I've, I've still not seen season two yet, but it's... It's You're uh, good. No, that's the right way. I was going the right way, huh? Yeah. All right. Okay. Oh, I'm in a weird niche where I don't have to press anything. So you got to okay. jump to jump, and then jump, duck. Jump, jump, duck. And I'll hold back. Kind of wants to push me, though, too. It's weird. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Fucking. Well, progression. Anyway. This is called progression. And nope. I'm going, I'm going the wrong way again. Nope. Nope. Go back. Go back. Go back. This way. Yeah. No. Nope. 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 Not this way. No. That way. This yeah. way. Yeah. Then. Because you're you're basically following the track above you. <laughs> yeah. I. It doesn't help that the. Uh, the rooms all look like just the same yeah. fucking yes, rectangle. The same. The same square, rectangle, gray, imperial designed rooms. No, left. Yep. And down. There we Perfect. Go. Look at that. Oh no, more. <laughs> more. No. I was just seeing if there was any. This game was forgiving and had, sa and had saves. This is where you'd save. <sighs> okay. Crouch. Duh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not that it would take me anywhere, I don't think, but. Uh. Okay, that stopped the conveyor. Okay, now. Oh, I can't go down there. Oh, no, no, no. I go uh, back. See, no, see if you can open a door there. I don't think it's. It's like a different texture. No, no, no. Uh, uh, where the conveyor is. Like it leads into the wall. Different texture. Nothing. No, uh, straight, straight ahead. This way. Oh yeah, right you're there. right. Yeah. All right. Nothing. Yeah. Nothing. Figures. Figures. Yeah. <sighs> no, I think I do. I drop down here, and I think there's a dark trooper down there, if I recall. Possibly. And luckily, the back wall is here, so he can pin me to my death immediately. You can stick that big sword thing in the keister. <laughs> yeah. Oh, maybe there's not one. Or maybe I was just getting paranoid again, thinking of the you gotta, previous section. You gotta save all your ammo for mock. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully I can cheese him like I usually do. Like I do Boba Fett. I don't like it when they give you two choices like that. Make it easy for me. Okay. Oh, this section. I remember this. I have to get the pattern. 
on the fucking thing and just another puzzle. Okay. Oh, this thing you gotta line up. Yeah, the, uh... it's not hard though. I remember it <clears throat> yeah. being relatively easy. Uh, let's see. I can start with the furthest one, which I think activates from that. Or which one did that do? <laughs> I don't know. I think it's doing a near one. Let's see. Damn it, I need to see which one is... Okay, that's that. Okay. There we go. Oh, damn it. I'm just guessing. And I think I raise the next one. Or maybe I do. Fucking A. The last one, I don't think moves. So that needs to be... That. Yeah. And then I think I go down the sequence here, from there. Yeah. This puzzle is way easier than the fucking or, uh, Coruscant. Security yeah. thing. Well, you're not having to do it in like 3D space, so. Yeah. Okay, I think that's it. Whatever that did. What did it do? I forget. Hope I don't have to lower something. No, I, that should be it, though. Mm, I think I go... You just go back, right? I go back somewhere. There's not another button over here, right? Okay, making sure. Yeah, I think I just go back and there's something different. Maybe this is unlocked now? Not that I went this way anyway, but... Oh, I think it just... It raised something. I think all those were lowered. That's my guess. I don't know. <laughs> we'll I don't know. remember. <laughs> I'm gonna guess there's a fucking ceiling turret in here. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. What are you doing? You're I, gonna run I out. Don't, I know, I know. I was like tr go. trying to quickly grab something. Okay, there we go. I'm use that on you too, buddy. Boom! <sighs> Alright, there's no ceiling turret, thank god. Alright, but you still gotta unlock this thing. Which is always easy, because there's always a shootable thing, I think, yeah. Yeah. I couldn't even hear that one. Jan would be proud. Okay, it was muffled from the machinery. Yeah, yeah. All okay. right, here we go. Yeah, I think Mock is coming up. Time to fuck Mock. <laughs> fuck you, asshole. <laughs> That's one of my favorite lines in Commando when he's fighting the. Uh, What's his face? Yeah, what's the guy's name with the mustache? No, it's not the mustache guy. It's the, it's the uh, man. I don't remember the actor's name either. The the super tall black guy from Oh Zoom yeah, Predator yeah. As well. Yeah. It's like I. It's I Bill eat something. For breakfast. It's Bill. Yeah, it's Bill. Yeah, because I wanted to call him Billy, but it's not Billy from Predator. Is Ma um, already out? I thought he. No, because he has a little line. That's right. So it's another dark trooper somewhere that I have to kill first, I think, or something, or more than one. There's these assholes. Oh, Bill, Bill Duke. That's it. I, 
I hear a dark trooper, so I'm gonna just fucking keep it on this. And he was Cook. Cook? Cook. T O O K in uh, Commando. Or is that Cookie? <laughs> You're all contemplating these for... things. I I'm know, yeah. Like, <laughs> mm, I... Sweating. <laughs> I ate green berries for breakfast. Oh, that's a great line. I love that line. He fucking goes to shoot him, and it's empty. Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> fuck. Fuck you, asshole. <laughs> okay. Now, let's see. I think what I do is I, I can... Before Mott comes out, I think I can open all these or something. Okay, there's another dark trooper. I remember this is just like the gauntlet before the fucking. Come on, come on, dude. There you go. Fucking. Get some more health. Why is that going out? That's scaring me. <laughs> oh, this. There's Mock. That's where he comes out of. It's gonna be that spot. So. I can't remember what activates him, but I'm going to grab everything I need. Okay. Interesting. You see, this is, this is like so unrelated to anything. So I go to look up Bill, Bill Duke, right? Yeah. And then I go on Commando and it's like, oh, uh, there's an actual link to the the woman that played the stewardess right on the plane it's chelsea field i'm like okay let's see what else she's done oh she's in like a bunch of movies including you know uh harley davidson and the marlboro man right um but but then i'm i'm like uh looking at pictures of her and there's a picture of her with scott scott bacula i was like oh is she married to scott bacula she is married to scott bacula hmm. so it's like you know it's, it's just weird to think, you know, yeah, that a bit part, you know, there's like these weird connections in Hollywood and stuff. No, it's true. It is strange. Well, I guess I'm done with everything up here. So I guess jumping down there activates him. But I, I thought he, it is here because I can see him when he, I don't know. Here we go. Oh, I think I hit that button and then ride it up again. That's what does it. Worthy. Come here, bastard. I wonder, you know, I didn't think about it, but I wonder if, um, like, you know, Moff Gideon had the, uh, the like, chest armor that had some, you yes. know, electronics in it. Is he, is he still flying the, around? No. Did you get him? That was his rockets that were attached to the walls. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've never um, seen that happen. But. So I wonder, I wonder if they thought about putting Moff Gideon into a dark trooper suit, kind of like Admiral Mock. Right, right. You know what I mean? It must have, you know what, it must have crossed their minds when they were planning stuff. Yeah, maybe, maybe he'll come back. I'm sure we'll see a, him again. It's a dark trooper. Yeah, well, what's his face? He's such a good actor. He's be a waste. Giancarlo Esposito. Yeah, yeah. Okay, now where do I go? I thought this would, I know I go to another hangar or something and then, uh, let's see. <laughs> I've defeated the final boss. Now what? Mm. I forget. Buttons. I, I I'm looking for an unhit button. Button button. Who's got the button? Um. It's uh, this is weird. Oh, she played. Uh, Chelsea Field played uh, Tila in that Masters of the Universe movie. Oh, okay. 
Wow. Uh, you know, you know what's imagine, funny? Imagine that's the high point of your career. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? I, I have not seen Masters of the Universe since it first hit VHS. It's, 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 I, I've never seen it. You've never seen I, it? Oh, it, it is love, good. It's good. Is it? it? Well, you know what? Okay. It's not good like Top Gun or Aliens good. Like, like, <laughs> right, not right. like that good. But if, if you're, if, if, when you appreciate it on a certain level, like the special effects are damn good. The, yeah. uh, the, I mean that. Well, I think yeah, it it it's looked flawed. Good, it's flawed. Well, but... it looked good as far as like casting and all this stuff, but I think my um, um, and like you know Skeletor's makeup and all this stuff, it it looked good as far as that, but my I think my the thing that turned me off always was that it was um set on Earth, you know? Yeah, yeah. And that that kind of thing, like, cause I especially as a kid, it was like oh, oh man, it I bugged see... me as a kid, definitely. I want to see Eternia or whatever it is. Yeah. Oh, here. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want them running around on Earth. Yeah. What boring. sucks is they're on Eternia like the first twenty or thirty minutes, and then it switches to Earth because they go through a portal or something like that. Yeah. All right. Here we man. go. There's the one officer left, and then there's the blocky poly polygonal shuttle. All right, the end of Dark Forces. <laughs> Next mission. Yes, Dark Forces 2. Ah, the Arc Hammer. Done. You know, they, they got to go back and add, you know, the, the central, you know, line like they added in uh, the special editions. <laughs> this is an unfortunate setback. The force is strong with Katan. That was a cool little tease for Jedi Knight by saying yeah. that. I like how Vader's kind of leaning forward in the <laughs> front shot, but then he's like normal in the other one. <laughs> right. The stereotypical Rebel Fleet shot with a, mm -hmm. a frigate and Corvettes. <laughs> that mm -hmm. anim animation obviously they added Kyle in, in the side but that was they just copied that animation from X-Wing yeah. it's even the same metal it's the star of Alderaan that we can get so that was just more assets we can reuse <laughs> go for <laughs> yeah don't think I didn't notice LucasArts ah Dark Forces I believe that was my fourth or fifth playthrough in my life. I think my fourth, actually. Yeah, I don't know. Might have been fifth. I forget. Good game, though. Who knows? Who knows? Who Good knows? game. Uh, I think it holds up great after 26 years now. Dude, you know what? I think it came out in February of 95, so... Almost exactly, because we were playing this in February of 2021. Well, I feel yeah. like it would it would be in sort of the rotation more for us and for other people, like Doom is. Yeah. If if there were you know modern source ports that made it easier yeah. to play on modern modern systems. Yes. And you could play around with stuff and upgrade the assets and all that stuff, but yeah. As it, as it is, it's oh, just Nick Jameson. So cumbersome. There Nick you go. Nick Jameson. He did. Oh, as oh, that's right. As Kyle. And uh, oh, that's well, and he was the Imperial voiceover too. It said. Yeah. He did a couple, and then of course Denny Delk, and I I think I mentioned that briefly in another uh, level early on in the game. Yes. He's done like a million voices, not just for Lucas Arts, but like. Lucasfilm in general, and I think mm -hmm. I'm probably going to go into that into that further because I want to go down his credits list on like a podcast episode. But he's in like more American Graffiti, the sequel. Like he he goes back to like 70s Lucasfilm. Like holy yeah. shit! But uh, I he's mean, he boy. was he was Zarin in Tie Fighter, and uh, I'll check that out. Joe Captain Trips Ashburn. <laughs> little stand reference 
but um i was gonna say like yeah we would probably revisit this more if it did have assets that could be upgraded and could do different things with it but as it is as just a standard star wars shooter i think it gets the job done it's i think modern gamers might not care unless they like obviously retro games but i think for us it's it's great to revisit Mm-hmm. yeah it's just not super easy motivation which i i don't even know i don't even know what the the holdup is or would be like for it it was super easy they you know carmack and them were just able to pull the trigger on that decision i don't know if there's other other things yeah. at play because oftentimes lucas lucas arts was just the publisher not the uh developer right on some stuff so i don't know if the hold up is if they have to get permission from the the developer for the code or whatever so, right or there's just not a there's just not a lot of interest in doing it in general so all right dark forces is over on to the next game uh very soon yoda and stories yoda stories uh, i don't know what it'll be but that's a candidate <laughs> <laughs> that's a no <laughs> that's a no uh until next time see ya good night what?